Hi everybody, it's Angie. I am back this evening with a Dollar Tree haul. This is the first of many series as I love going to the Dollar Tree and getting fun little goodies and checking it out. I feel like I could stay in the Dollar Tree for hours, which I do, going up and down the aisles many, 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 many times because there's so much and you could just miss it and you don't want to. So. Yes, yeah, so went to the Dollar Tree today with the little one to get some items for her birthday party as well as other random assorted items. So let's get into it. So my first item that we picked up was this birthday hat. So it's rather large and um, it's very holographic. As you can tell, it's purple with polka dots. It has some fun little shimmers at the bottom and some at the top. And it just goes over her head with a little strap. So. Um, her puppy or her puppy her theme is puppies and she's having a puppy party not to be confused with the puppy party and um, these are the colors that were in her invitations and in her thank you cards and in her uh, cupcake toppers so this we thought would be really fun for her to have and let's just see here what else so I got two packs of these called they're called Whack-A-Packs and they are balloons and you're supposed to smack the pack and it should pop the outer pack right here and then the balloon inflates. So I wasn't sure about the size of a balloon so <laughs> I tried one and they're this size so they fit, oops, sorry, they fit basically in the palm of your hand and they have a little uh, hanger here that you could put it in. They're really cute as you can hear there's some stuff inside so that's what helped um, get it to blow up so these are fun I got uh, two packs of these thought they'd be fun for the party just to have those little maybe decorations on the table not really 100% sure didn't really think it through but um, got those those will be fun <laughs> and then I picked up probably the most boring thing ever a pair of scissors so I do a lot of coupon cutting and I haven't been able to find my scissors so I've been having to use a knife or tear my coupons out so a dollar store I needed a scissors I don't know where my other one went so I got those my next item that I got is for the party and oh, <laughs> and they are these two tissue pom-poms so they're these little guys that these little pom-pom balls that you can hang from the ceiling or put on the table I got yellow and I also got purple and then I got these um, hanging tissue paper pom-pom garlands that are really similar to these but it's a garland and it's a nine foot garland um, so I got one of those as well in pink these go with her color theme so um, they should hopefully work perfect for the party and kind of moving off of the party we picked up a manuscript tablet so she is going to be going into kindergarten in the fall and she is already writing and reading and doing math basic math subtraction addition all of that so uh, got this for her so she can practice and be ahead of the game before she even goes into kindergarten and yeah she loves writing she loves learning we do learning exercises every night we read every night um, so that is definitely something that she is super excited about using also picked up this numbers and counting homework helper it's for kindergarten age and it just has a bunch of little activities so as you can see here um seven so trace and write the word color the seven candles um so just stuff like that uh, she really likes these kind of things they challenge her um, and they just really help um, reiterate the writing so we have the the the, <laughs> the number one which she can write a couple times across here and then she can also practice in her manuscript tablet so um, she's really good at writing and really good at spelling and so we are super excited about these items every time we go to the dollar store we pick up at least one or two books for learning so she has a ton um, it's kind of getting hard to find new ones because she has so many already but um, you know since we do it every night uh, we just don't want her to get bored we want her to stay 
interested, we want her to be engaged, and we just want her to be um, excited to learn. So that was a good find that I found. And then <laughs> these are toddler sunglasses. So summer is coming to an end here in Minnesota here, upcoming pretty quickly. And I don't know how many pairs of sunglasses that girl has, but um, she has lost every single pair. So got these, I thought they were really cute. She has a pair of black ones, we don't know where they are. Very similar to this, the pink is cute. Um, so we thought, okay, one more, one more pair of sunglasses before the season is done and then we will start over fresh next year. Um, hopefully being able to keep track of our sunglasses a little better. The next items that I got are these sticky notes. They're hashtags. I just thought they were kind of cute. Um, so I picked up one for myself, which was the pink. So it's kind of a, like a, a, a nice, cute, pinky color. And then I got this blue one for my best friend, Amanda. We are also known as the double A's. <laughs> so I got one of these for both of us. Um, and I'll bring them into work tomorrow. And she will love it. And we'll just have a great time with these. So I thought they were really cute. And then the next items we got are called drop gouts, goots, odor eliminating drops, goots anti-odor. Oh, <laughs> that's another language. Hello, Angie. So odor eliminating drops. So I'm assuming that these are like the poopery. Um, it doesn't look like they have a scent listed on here, but... Uh, it basically just creates an odor blocking layer. You just need one or two drops. Um, <laughs> probably TMI, but I have the poopery and it retails for $15. These were a dollar each. If they work, perfect. I keep one in my bathroom. All right, not sure what happened there, but I keep uh, one of these in every bathroom in my house. And the rule in my house is if you do a number two, you need to use a poopery. Either you need to spray it in the air or you need to spray it in the toilet before you go because nobody wants to smell that. I'm sorry. I know everybody does it, but I don't want to smell it. You don't want to smell it. My dog doesn't want to smell it. Jesus doesn't want to smell it. Like, just use a poopery, please. <laughs> and the next item that I got are this Clar and Danver liquid hand soap. I got the Apple Fields. Um, I really love this brand. I feel like you get the most bang for your buck. You get a 15 ounce bottle for a dollar. Um, so I got that kind. And then I also got the Berry Delicious. So um, these are really great. They are very cleansing. They're very moisturizing. Um, I used to be the type of person that would only buy the Bath and Body Works. Well, when you get older and you try to just, you know, watch what you're spending your money on and being fiscally responsible, spending $5 on a hand soap is not the right choice. So, at least for me. I mean, everybody teach their own, but a dollar, these are great. You use them in the bathroom all the time. And then I just got some kitchen items. Now, I usually never get kitchen items or food items, I should say, at the dollar store. Um, but this time I just couldn't pass these up. So these are the Rotel Original Diced Tomatoes and Green Chilies, perfect for um, chilies and, and various different food items. I make a lot of um, like ground beef, zucchini boats, where you put the ground beef and the tomatoes and cheese and all sorts of veggies and you put them in a zucchini. I do a zucchini lasagna, which these would be perfect for. So uh, these definitely will go um, in handy. So I got two, two, uh, two cans of those. And then my last items are these Hunt's Diced Tomatoes, 100% natural. Again, I use a lot of tomatoes in my cooking. Um, pretty much, I would say 70% of my uh, cooking items or cooking uh, recipes include tomatoes. We eat a lot of them here. So while we're waiting for our tomatoes in the garden to ripen, these we'll just have to do for now. But once those are ripe and ready to go, um, we will be using those instead of these. But for right now, they're not ready. So yeah, that is what I got. A lot of stuff for the party, a lot of learning stuff, the poopery. I'm really hoping that this works um, because yeah, the 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 poopery, the real actual poopery stuff is, is getting quite expensive. Um, like I said, it's it's fourteen dollars, and if you put it in both your bathrooms. Oh, and I also take it on a trip. Every trip I go on, when you get a bunch of girls in a room, and there's booze and there's food, and no matter how the girls try to be, you know, dainty, and you know, people thinking girls don't go number two, girls stink. So. 
he's come everywhere. <laughs> and then, yeah, just a lot of fun stuff. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed my haul. Um, and yeah, if you like what you see, um, please subscribe. I would love it. I would really appreciate it. And if you have any questions, please feel free to ask in the comments below. And I will let y'all know how this goes. Um, and if you guys are the poopery lovers out there and want to save some money and if this stuff works, I mean, there, this could be a new go-to. So, yeah. Anyways, I hope everybody has a wonderful evening and a great rest of their week. And it looks like we're going to be getting some rain here in Minnesota. So, um, stay dry if you're getting rain. So, um, yeah, I will see you all later. Thank you. Goodbye.